Yo, what's up, Squirtle Shader crew? This is your leader, the Squirtle Shader JD Zero, and this, uh, as you can tell, I have a new little intro for versus battles against people. Now, um, basically, I have a uh, speaking of a versus battle, I have a PokeTuber go by Typhlosion64 Gaming. His link will be in the description down below. Uh, basically, I just got it. I just got in contact with him over uh, Pokemon Amino. He's been commenting on my videos, letting me know that he wants to verse, you know, gets me into this PokeTuber battle. So this is our 30th two battle that I recently have against PokeTubers and whatnot. Um, but yeah, uh, we got a, what was it, a, um, it is, it's a couple of things that you see here that we have, I'm um, gonna be wrecking out with a U2, a Blastoise, and a Lucario, while he's gonna be wrecking out with, uh, two of his starters will be the Skeptile, and, um, it was that one, Del Fox and you. Uh, uh, basically, it's a three on three versus match. So I was just, you know, excited to do this. It only go about eight rounds out of this match. And it was a pretty cool, close match. So I'm just gonna go ahead and play it. Um, but yeah, it was a very close match, as you're gonna see here. Uh, and and again, um, just to let you know, guys, if you did like the little versus intro that I have now for what I do versus videos, it's gonna be uh, you know, just go by the like button, and let me know if you like it or not, or comment down below. Uh, I go for a mega. I go for the Lucario first. I go for the mega. Uh, I felt like I should have just. Uh, Sword Dance first instead of doing for the close combat because I noticed how much it, I got uh, attack for like uh, basically since I didn't know he was gonna go for a psychic or a flamethrower I don't know how much damage it would have taken but it didn't took any it didn't take a lot from that psychic move that it did so I feel like I should have just went for the sword stance get the plus two and then close combat. Cause I probably would have taken it out with a plus two. And, I, and then he sends out uh, his Skeptile. Now I was able to one shot his Skeptile. That was good. But like I said, I feel like I should have gotten the plus two first. And at least that would have been easier. Instead of having to deal with that. He goes to his Mega Mewtwo X. And I decided just to go ahead bullet punch. I'm not even gonna try to uh, close combat it. I sh I feel like close combat should have did a little bit more if I should have just went into it instead of the bullet punch. But I just wanted to see if I could still outspeed it anyway. Uh, yeah, I sent out my Mewtwo um, Saitama and I go for the EQ. EQ did a pretty good amount, not too much. He goes for the Ice Beam. Ice Beam did a pretty good amount as well. Not too much. I go for a Drain Punch trying to get a little bit health back. And I see they took a little bit health away from him. And then it made it seem like I should have just go for another EQ instead to get the crit. That was not the case. So I go for another Ice Punch and another Psychic. Kid to me. And then it just ends up uh, killing off the Mewtwo. But then I started to switch in, and once I had finished switched in, I switched into Blastoids for my last mod. He goes for another Psychic, ends up killing off the. Uh, ends up not killing off my Blastoids. Kind of did a little good amount of damage, but then I used the Dark Pulse to actually end the Mewtwo. So if you guys enjoyed this, please 
uh, comment, share, scuzz us that like button, picture square shades on, stay awesome guys, bye.